In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to run Yota Cloud 24-7 as a Windows service with Always Up. You will be able to start Yota Cloud as soon as your computer boots, even before you log in, to ensure that your files and folders synchronized across all your devices. To configure Yota Cloud with Always Up 8.5 and later, you'll need to first download and install Always Up and then install Yota Cloud Windows Client if you don't already have them installed on your system. To install Always Up, go to http colon forward slash forward slash www.coretechnologies.com forward slash products forward slash always up forward slash. On the Always Up page, right click the download link and then save as to your computer. Now start Always Up. Select application and then add to open the add application window. In the Application field, enter the full path to the Yota Cloud executable, yota.exe. If you installed Yota Cloud in the default location, it will be C colon backslash program files backslash yota backslash yota.exe. In the Name field, enter the name that you will call this application in Always Up. We used Yota Cloud for this tutorial, but you can enter any name you like. Next, click over to the Log On tab and enter the username and password of the Windows account in which you installed and configured Yota Cloud. Yota Cloud must run in this account so that it can find its settings. Next, click over to the Startup tab and check the Ensure that the Windows Networking Components have started box. This informs Always Up that Yota Cloud needs TCP IP networking support to do its work. Click the Save button. In a couple of seconds, Yota Cloud will now show up in the Always Up window, but it is not yet running. Before we start Yota Cloud as a Windows service, you'll need to prevent a second copy from starting when you log on. To do so, start Yota Cloud if necessary. Click on the Start button, All Programs, Yota Cloud, and then Yota Cloud. Right click on the Yota Cloud tray icon and select Settings. Now, uncheck the Launch Yota Cloud when the computer starts box. Note that this setting is somewhat misleading. It will only start Yota Cloud after you log in. If Yota Cloud is running, stop it now by right-clicking on the tray icon and choosing Quit. To start Yota Cloud from Always Up, choose Application and then Start Yota Cloud. After a couple of seconds, the state should transition to running. Please note that you won't see Yota Cloud's icon in the taskbar nor will you see the nice icons in your Yota Cloud folder, because Yota Cloud is running in the background, in Session 0, but your files will be synchronized as normal. Because of Session 0 isolation on Windows 8, 7, and Vista, and Windows Server 2012 and 2008, you can click on Application and then Start Yota Cloud in this session, if you wish to start Yota Cloud on your desktop and interact with its tray icon normally in this session. That's it! Next time your computer boots, Yota Cloud will start up immediately, before anyone logs on. We encourage you to edit the Yota Cloud entry in Always Up and check out the many other settings that may be appropriate for your environment. Thanks for watching!